Hey guys, this is a demonstration of the latest version of my notification uh, ticker made using Tasker. Uh, I'm going to show you how it displays the name of the song you're currently listening to in Google Play Music, although obviously it can be used with Spotify or YouTube Music if you for some reason use that. Uh, so uh, if you look in the top left hand corner, you'll see I've already got a couple of notification icons there. Uh, I'm just going to click play on the Google Play Music widget in the middle of the screen. Uh, you'll hear Fiona Apple starts playing. And then, um, so in the top left hand corner of the screen, the other notification icon and the timer cleared to make room for the ticker, while the um, Google Play Music icon is left there. Uh, you might have also seen that um, there's a little, which I'm just going to mute this for copyright reasons uh you might have seen uh in the middle of the screen like a little black bar flashed um i didn't see that because it's hidden by uh the notch of my phone you'll also see there's like an angled mask on the right side of the ticker so it lines up with the notch uh, if you don't have a notch you can make the ticker wider so that i think that black bar basically always um displays but you can make the ticker wider so it's off the screen so you don't see it uh the other thing is usually i would just have this uh the ticker scroll across the screen once but um i've set it to scroll multiple times so i can show you all of the different versions of it so if i open the app drawer now which is so that hasn't worked now it's worked. Uh, so tiny bit uh, buggy, <laughs> not my fault. Uh, just uh, yeah, there are limitations, and I've started recording now, so I'm not going to do it again. But uh, you see that the notification has gone grey now, uh, so it can be seen against the app drawer, and so it uh, matches the colour of the notification icon. And if I close the app drawer, it should go back to white, which it has. If I open the app drawer again. Yeah, so it just it didn't recognize the the um, well actually. So I used the uh, window uh, variable, the built-in window variable for um, in Tasker to recognize when the app drawer is open, and uh, it can be a little bit um, quirky. It doesn't always give you the values that you expect. So that's probably what has happened there. But if I so it's all working okay now. Uh, if I go into a full screen app, um, a landscape full screen map in particular. Uh, in this case, Alto's Odyssey. You will see you get uh, a different version of the uh, notification ticker against the uh, translucent black background. So you can see it against the app. And then if I go into uh, the overview screen, overview screen, which isn't full screen. Uh, you'll get a different version again. Uh, there is, yeah, the, the transition from the full screen version to the non full screen version is a bit, um, not great. Uh, that's just to do with the way that, um, auto tools, web screens, the dimensions are formatted. Uh, I tried playing around with, um, H the HTML to avoid that, but, and it's possibly possible, but, uh, just it's such a uh I think it is such an edged case that it wasn't uh worth worrying about too much. Uh you'll see now it's gone back into portrait mode and I just wanted to show you what happens if I receive a notification while the ticker is viewable. So if I open messages, you see it's gone black again because messages um appears white in the status bar so I'll just quickly send myself a message and yep all right it wasn't gonna work go wait for a moment wait for that to come through is it coming through yeah so you see that it briefly appears and sometimes it will overlay the uh ticker that again is unavoidable but um yeah if you're not looking straight at it, which you're unlikely to be doing most of the time, you're not going to notice it has cleared to make way for 
Sika. And also, uh, I want to point out that that's only with uh, apps that don't pop up. So usually, apps that don't have a pop up unit notification, heads up notifications. I've turned off heads up notifications for this demonstration. Usually, I would get a heads up notification for messages when I receive a text, which opens the notification shade, which cancels the ticker. So if I open the notification now, shade to show you now, if I now close the notification shade, see the ticker's gone and all the icons are back. 